Hello, everybody, and welcome to Shape It Up Over 40. Um, I am feeling pretty okay today. I, If you're watching this on the video, I sort of did my hair today. I put makeup on. I got out of my pajamas. It's a good day. <laughs> I still have this incredible nagging cough. Um, head is still congested, but I am happy to say I'm on the other side of whatever this head cold thing that's running rampant in South Jersey. Um, so today we are on day eight of the 29 gifts. If you are just hopping in and have no idea what I'm talking about, it's okay. I read a book, which I'm almost done. <laughs> I'm joking about this book because um, I didn't, I only finished half of it and I was like, I'm in. Anyway, the book is called 29 Gifts. It's by Cami Walker. And it is basically a story where she got married and then shortly after her marriage, she found out she had um, multiple sclerosis and is just feeling down in the dumps about, you know, the disease that she now has to live with and has to contend with and how frustrating it is because she was very active and all that. And um, she kind of was spiraling and not in a good headspace. Um, and then one of her teachers suggested that she give away 29 gifts. So one gift per day for 29 days to see the effect that she has on her life and on the people around her. So uh, I am at the tail end of the book. I'm reading about other people doing the 29 uh, gift challenge, which is what she calls it. Um, so technically I am done the book. I'm just reading a little bit more about what other people have done. So I am on day eight and I'm happy to say that, um, I was really sick. Like <laughs> I did not want to get out of bed. I didn't really want to do anything. Um, but I stuck with the podcast, uh, granted they're only like two minutes long, so not that big of a deal, but you know, when you're sick, uh, well, at least for me. I, the last thing I kind of want to do is be public about it, but um, I made a commitment to the 29 days and I did not want to fall off, especially so early. Not that I want to fall off on day 27 or 28 either, but um, I find it sometimes is a little easier to fall off when you're at the beginning. It's kind of like when you start working out, you know, you go in for a week and you're like, oh, why am I doing this? But um which isn't always the case. I just want you to know there is a way to work out and have it be fun and want to continue after a week in. I digress, but welcome to Shape It Up Over 40. Uh, if you don't know me, my name is Nicole Simonin. I am a personal trainer and I am a health and fitness coach. Um, thanks to COVID, my business has completely pivoted to completely online and I absolutely love what I do. And I will be sharing some client stories as this month goes on, um, not just only on the 29 day, uh, you know, I want to share that, what gift I'm giving, but I also want to let you know what's going on um, throughout the month at Shape It Up. So today is day 28, and today I am going to drop off a big bag of towels to the animal shelter. That is what I'm giving today. So I am excited for those towels to hopefully provide some comfort, some warmth, some cleaning, whatever they need at the animal shelter today. Um, so that is my day eight gift. Um, it's interesting when I started this, uh, you know, the day one, if you listen to that podcast or that video, um, I talked about giving and receiving. And I, want to you to know like there there is two sides to the coin so um it'll be interesting to see how the month evolves um i feel like i've already received some wonderful gifts uh from giving um i was comped some tickets for some fantastic events uh one i already went to and one is coming up in the near future so as we progress through the 29 days, I will be sharing you anything that I have been receiving too, because that is part of it. And I think, uh, like I said, on day one, you know, as women, we tend to not want to receive. We tend to just be like, no, I, I don't want that. No, I don't need that. But 
allowing yourself to receive compliments. I know we talked about that on day one. Allow yourself to receive things that people are giving to you is also part of the process. All right. So that is day eight for the gift. Um, again, I'm going to go donate some towels to the animal shelter. And I also wanted to let you know that coming up on November 6th, um, of 2021, I am doing the Crusher Cravings workshop. It's an hour long workshop where I'm going to teach you my skill sets for crushing your cravings. And it's a one hour workshop. You are going to get a workbook with it. And you're also going to get a 30 minute private coaching call with me to work on your cravings specifically. Um, I, I, do not miss this. It's, uh, I don't know how many more live ones I am going to be doing. So definitely check that out. If you're listening to this and the date has passed, check out that link that I'm going to let you know in a second. Um, and you never know when uh, the workshop, I, I have thoughts of continuing the workshop, but it'll be kind of an on demand where you can just watch it whenever you want. So check it out. The website is End Cravings dot gr8.com again end cravings with an s dot gr the number eight dot com uh, remember that is november 6 from 10 a.m to 11 a.m eastern time i cannot wait to see you there i'm telling you if you are struggling with cravings especially because the holidays are right around the corner you need to be at this workshop so check it out Go register and I will see you there and I will talk to you tomorrow for day nine. Take care.